So, uh, what's in Roblox? So, uh, here's a list. We got platformers, shooters, RPGs as in role plays, survival games, it's in quite a bit more. Well, uh, I play this role playing game called Poly Sonic with my friends usually. Yeah, I know, a shocker considering I haven't done a Sonic video in a while. But anyways, um, this video is kind of, you know, Sonic and Roblox mixed together as a topic, but whatever. So let's cut to the chase. So before people click off this video, cause I'm not getting what they want, I came up with this idea today and I'm gonna see how much rings are in Poly Sonic. But I do have a rule set. One, I can't get any respawning rings. Two, I must find a way to get everywhere to ensure that I have every ring. And three, I have to do every area the game has. So without further ado, let's start with this challenge. First up on the list, we've got the very obvious green hill. First, I collected the rings on the bridge. Well, after literally running through them all at first. After that, I jumped on the two springs. After that, I went up this hill, but there ended up being no rings there, which is kind of a bummer considering, I'm gonna be honest, this is my favorite part about Green Hill. Like, I don't know, but the, the hill was just like, looks so weird. But I mean, there could have been rings there. Yeah, there honestly really could have. Then I noticed a tunnel. So I went there and there was a bunch of rings there. After that, I avoided these three springs, along with the knowledge that I had already got them already and they had respawn which big surprise i didn't get them so now i have to do this whole challenge over again perfect and it just so happens that i didn't get every ring on my second attempt either so after that i went back to the two springs that i didn't get the rings on and after that i just put the total of plus 16 because uh well i forgot those 16 so yeah on the screen you're always going to be seeing a plus 16 because uh I'm not gonna get them and I didn't get them in the footage and I'm not doing this again. So uh, yeah, then we can determine how much rings are actually in the game. That was the last bit of rings from Green Hill though. So let's move on to Marble Zone. And uh, before I actually start up with Marble Zone, I'm gonna just say this place is a pretty familiar uh, area with me. And seeing as I know it well, I can 100% clarify that this area is really, really bone dry with rings. First I went to get the rings on these three springs. Looked around and went to this cave. At first glance, you'll see a square of rings. There's nine rings in total, so I obviously collected those, which was followed by another set of nine rings. And then that's basically all the Marble Zone, sadly. And then I just left Marble Zone with 213 rings. Very small difference compared to Green Hill's ring count. So let's go to the secret lab, the smallest area in the game. You know, I think it's incredibly safe to say that there is no rings here at all. So now let's go to the Badlands. And gee, this area is even more bone dry than Marble Zone. And I mean that very literally because there's not a single ring here like the secret lab. It's a bummer considering this is such a large area, but I mean, whatever. Let's continue to the final area. The drum roll please, test zone, yay. All right, so uh, let's get straight to the zone because I honestly want this short ass video to be done with already. Most of the map doesn't have rings at all, honestly. Not the green screen, not the springs. Not even under these set of boxes has rings, but there is one spot that's got a prick load of rings. It's in the room next to the set of boxes. After doing some totally insanely hard platforming, you get up there into this very small room. It's like that section of Majora's Mask where you have to keep jumping to get these chests with a hundred ribbies. Off top of this crap, but anyways. So uh, this small room, it's got a whopping 66 rubies. Now that doesn't even seem like a lot considering I literally just now was just talking about a chest in Majora's Mask that's got 100 rubies or tying in with context uh, rings, but still. Now's the time that I answer the big question. How many rings are in Polysonic? The total turned out to be 283 plus the extra forgotten 16 from earlier. So with the 16 ring count, it goes to uh, 299. And before I sign off, I want to say the real max of the rings uh, is kind of infinite since the rings uh, respawn. But hey, for all I know, at the 999 billion ring count, the game could just crash. And trust me, I'm not going to get to that counter. Trust me. And uh, see you later. Watch another video on screen.